Hey, welcome back to Ramsey Land. Today we're gonna to make potassium chloride out of hydrochloric acid and potassium. Check it out. All you need for this reaction is some potassium. I've got it stored in some mineral oil over here. A little bit of hydrochloric acid, graduated cylinder, a dropper, and a spatula to cut pieces of potassium, and of course some coffee to keep yourself from going completely insane. Potassium is really an amazing metal. It has 19 protons. It has the consistency of cottage cheese. It can be very easily cut. And you can see when you remove that oxide layer how bright and shiny it is. It's actually the seventh most abundant element on Earth and makes up over 2% of the Earth's crust. The next step is to add about 10 to 20 milliliters of hydrochloric acid to your graduated cylinder. And that's plenty for this reaction. This is a single displacement reaction, and so when your potassium comes in contact with your hydrochloric acid, it's going to displace pure hydrogen gas, and of course the potassium is gonna bond with the chlorine to make potassium chloride. Here we go. I would start by adding just very small pieces of potassium for this reaction. Potassium is a beautiful red flame when it ignites. And again, the product in this is potassium chloride, which is a salt that will form during the reaction. Here's another small piece. Exothermic reaction. Well, I hope you enjoyed today's edition of Ramsey Land, and I'll see you next time.